show you how to take the fluorescent fixture apart and prepare it to receive the solid state lighting or LED bulbs. One of the things that we'll have to do is access the ballast compartment and every brand of fixture is a little bit different. This particular one has been in service for quite a while and it uses screws to hold the cover on. The LED bulb is going to require us to energize one set of pins with the line voltage. In this particular case, we have 277 volts coming into the fixture. So the first thing I want to do is disconnect the main power from the ballast and get the ballast out of the system. When you make this change, you can actually remove the ballast from the fixture because it has nothing to do with anything in, after that. And one, one system that we found that works pretty well is to find the yellow set of wires. And in this case, this one's already been converted over to the electronic ballast. But in the older ballast, there was two yellow wires going to each socket and then jumping over to the other socket. So these two yellow wires right here are key to making this conversion very fast and very easy. One of these yellow wires I will connect to line and one of these yellow wires I'll connect to neutral coming into the fixture. And I, in some cases I can recycle some of these other wires and just make them longer and get back to it. This particular fixture is a four bulb fixture, so if I energize these two yellow wires, one on line and one on neutral, and then take this other yellow set over here and break them apart and put one on line and one on neutral, then I'm done. And I can take this ballast out of the fixture and I've already wired to all of the yellow pins so I'm going to take one yellow wire and put it on line and one yellow wire on neutral. I'm going to add these two yellow wires to line and neutral. I'll probably just have to make them a little bit longer. But I could go ahead and ignore all of the red wires and the blue wires and even take this ballast clear out of the fixture. So the line power coming in is going to these two sets on this set of yellow wires and these outer sets on this set of yellow wires and then all I have to do is snap in the new LED bulbs and it's ready to go up. So it's really not as hard of a change out as it might look. All we have to do is bypass the ballast and get the voltage. In this particular case it's 277 volts, but the new solid state lighting bulbs that we're working with have multiple voltage inputs, 120, 277, so you don't really have to worry about matching them up like we used to have to on the old ballasts, make sure that they match the incoming line voltage.